the ugliest sunset I've ever seen. I mean, you know, it's alright. It's, it's all right so gray. Time. It's sepia. Throw some well, pinks yeah. in there, geez. <laughs> they could only do so much. Huh? They could only do so much. I'm gonna do the tree and a raw tarot. We have some pretty important things here at Rim Elm. No, yeah, don't go giving me, give me a big head about it. Rim Elm is here, thank you. He's already got a big head. <laughs> that was my joke. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you are totally correct. <laughs> thank you again. However, get out of our town. Get the fuck out of here, go do some shit. It's about our precious maid. Her mother shall be alive inside the mist. Hell, nobody lives. No, everybody lives. They just become zombies. Oh. If you have uh, That was not explained to me. If you have pity on Mary, then rescue her mother. Well, I'm kind of skipping ahead in the explanation. Okay. Because <laughs> it hasn't been explained yet. Well... It's not very that's important. Just spoilers. It's not very important. It's not. Very I'll tell you the rest of the story. Will you do it? No. I'm sorry you're concerned about me too. Will you do it? No. I'm sorry. <laughs> See, this is what I thought the meta was gonna <laughs> <Yeah>. do. <laughs> I'm sorry you're concerned about me too. Will you do it? Will you do it? No. I'm sure you're concerned you little fuck. about me too. Will you do it? <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, thank you. I'm glad I didn't have to ask you more than once. <laughs> no, even May doesn't know that. But May's mother, Maya, used to work at Byron Monastery. Ten years ago, the mist came. And naturally, we lost all contact with her. As for where Byron <coughs> Monastery itself is still left driving the mist. Unfortunately, I know it. But my eyes might have to be a bit better. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This guy's devolving into just gibberish. <laughs> <laughs> I got tired of doing him. My mother, no. Keep this a taker from me. She will only be heartbroken if Byron Monastery has indeed been lost to the mist. Well, let's go find out. Basically, basically whenever you're like uh, a zombie with a seru on your arm, or wherever it decides to attach to you, mm -hmm. uh, you're a you're a zombie that has like you can't control your own mind, but you don't need to eat. You don't need to drink anything, and you basically live forever. Well. So, people can, like, survive in the mist with, like, Seru, like, stuck on them, uh, for as long as they need to, until somebody can actually save them. You'll need weapons and armor, Sean. No, I, I know about weapons and armor. I, I want that card, though. Don't know anything, <laughs> do you? This is a shop. <laughs> Shut up! Ah, <laughs> oh, dude, I have like. I have a good amount of money already. Let's cool. get in here. Let's see if I can get this. Drawer won't open, it's locked. Freaking look up that drawer! <laughs> <laughs> I would like to just like a, a shot of them downstairs and just hearing you like, God damn it, this thing won't open! Where's the key? This stupid thing! I need the key! <laughs> okay, I need the head and... <laughs> just them I'm gonna them go with the... Uh, Narflak will equip. Alright, I went for the boots first. Let's Why'd you go for that first? One healing leaf. Huh? Okay. Rim Elm Shop. Upstairs. Friggin' 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 drawer. Friggin' friggin'. No fact, do you remember that Zeto? It looked like he was after our village's genesis tree. 
I, it's been a little while since we've saved. Because it's got something really useful that I want inside. <clears throat> <laughs> get it. Get it, get it. Maybe you give it. I want to say it like you knew. But the store doesn't exist anymore. I wonder how this town got its name. I think it, it probably was like Rim Job Elm. Before, <laughs> but then they like decided they changed the name. So I'm like, you know what? You can't let them know what we like to do around here. Get, get in there! Get in there! I know the trick too. Do you? I know what I know what it is. You like, you have to open <laughs> the bottom drawer first. Sure, tell me about it. Maybe this will proc it. No! God dang it, gimme you freaking... GIVE IT TO ME! <coughs> oh my god. Bless you. There you go. I know. Felt that coming. It hurt me. Stupid. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna like... I'm gonna cut it. <laughs> you're gonna I'm gonna cut it. Cut what? I'm gonna cut this where we're trying to figure out the. <laughs> figure out where the. <laughs> okay, I figured it out. <laughs> where is it? What are you gonna do? I gotta leave first. <laughs> Alright. Wheat! Nerve leg! Oh, I'm glad I murdered it. Here, I brought you the hunting clothes I promised you. About time. Now I have the hunter clothes. And this is a gift for you to thank you for rushing to check up on me yesterday. Yeah! I got May's pendant, and that's all I wanted from you. <laughs> hey, Nerf Leg! What's this is name? all I need from you. Mind your own business. <laughs> hey, you're so cute when you get a mirrors like that. <laughs> Knife leg. I wasn't trying to be cute. I want to go see other girls. I heard from the village elder that you're going on a long trip. Well, take care. And don't forget to wear the hunting outfit I made you. Oh, I will wear it until I find something better. <laughs> <laughs> we'll wear it until that better thing comes along. And then I'll sell it, and then I'll tell you that I sold it whenever you ask if I still have it. <laughs> I've never been good at saying goodbyes. So I have to go home now. I'm sorry. Just be like, bye. I'll be waiting for you to come back, Nerflack. I don't care. <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> Quip it. Quip it. Now I have more defense. Quip now out. I can leave. And you're gonna run right and back in. And then I'm in. gonna run right back in. <laughs> oh man, that town is smaller than that than I thought. No, we're just bigger on the map. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming in here. Uh, you, you, you son of a bitch! I don't need it. I don't need you. I, I can just go steal <laughs> from you. I don't know why I talk to them. There's point card in the drawer. I feel like it has a point card. Oh. What's that for again? Uh, it. I get, like, stuff. From who? Like, hold on. It. <laughs> let me, like, actually look at it because it's hard to explain. Earn points worth 5% of the price when you shop. So basically, whenever I shop, I get 5% of what I paid. And then, uh, I think it, like, lets out an attack. Huh. Or something like that, whenever I... Uh, 
Okay. That, it wasn't the right card. I thought it was something else. Because <laughs> there's this other card where you get, like, uh, secret items at item shops. <laughs> oh, oh, no! The world breaks away because the slime is the ultimate monster. <laughs> the slime! Yeah! I got boots Fuck from the you, store! You still hurt pretty. <laughs> Why are you so strong, slime? Why are you so strong? Slime is the strongest monster. Yes, <sighs> slime is the final boss. I knew it was frogs all along! <laughs> Alright, so now, I guess you That's know. Place. Huh? This? <laughs> I guess we'll go look at it because you wanted me to. I mean, I just said, what's that place? And you went over there. Oh, Narflak! I'm glad you came. I'm impressed. You made it here all by yourself? No. Oh, so the Rossaru Meta is with you, eh? Yeah. Now I feel like you've grown into a fine adult. I know, it's only been like a day. Yeah! <laughs> By the way, Narflak, see that guy over there? That little pansy? That little posh little pretty punk? boy? Don't know him. Well, we come here often, but this is the first time we've met someone else here. It says his name is Lazam. Lazam! And he was Lazam. telling us the most amazing story. Hello, my name is Lazam. <laughs> Narflak, you should talk to Lazam too. Alright. Nope. <laughs> Let's drink from the spring. Delicious. Now these things tell you stuff, but I don't I don't need to know. Are you sure what if we I wanna know? I am called Lazam. I serve King Drake. Ruler of Drake Kingdom. So oh, yeah. you are Narflag. The hunters have told me all of you. <laughs> all of you. <laughs> you have done great deeds. You have my gratitude. Tell me why you're grateful. Yes, this is about something that happened yeah. before the Mist reached here. I was heading to Rimelm under King Drake's orders. To warn them of the mist. But the mist caught up with me, and I became a Seru monster. From what I've heard, hell, it is your deeds <laughs> that enable me to become human again. That is why I'm grateful. Thank you so much. Drake is surrounded by the mist. King Drake is surely awaiting you, your powers. With your powers, our castle could be saved. Will you help us? No. Mm. Mm, no. <laughs> oh, I see. Perhaps I ask too much. I am sure you have your own quests to pursue. I apologize. Before departing, King Drake made a decision of great consequence. One that is difficult to discuss. If you wish to know the consequences of that decision, then go to Drake Castle and see for yourself. <laughs> if you're curious, go fix the problem. <laughs> you're right. <laughs> I love how I struggled with what I was giving him at first, but then <laughs> I kind of got into it. Yeah. Uh, oh no, there's two. No! This is basically the strength of a supernova. Oh my god. Kick and punch the slime! That should work, right? No? Uh, it, uh, yeah, it seems to be working. It seems to be working, but should it? It seems we found their weakness. Does punching Flubber just... make it work? I think they're just making it look like it's working and dissipating into the grass. They're like, whoop. And then they're gonna sneak up on you later it's on. It's really annoying that he keeps punching me, so I'm just gonna sink into the grass and <laughs> act like I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, I got another level. Yeah. 
What is that, level 99? It should be... Three! Three? Level three! That's some bull honky. Uh, we've been playing this forever! <sighs> For hours! Hours! Ugh!